the coronavirus is in a constant arms race against our immune system. It will keep evolving. A mutation is a genetic change, a variant is a virus with a specific set of mutations. Three distinct versions of the virus seem to have independently converged on some of the same mutations, despite being thousands of miles apart in the United Kingdom, South Africa and Brazil. All three variants seem to be becoming more common and are more transmissible. A particular mutation in the spike protein called N501Y is noteworthy because all three variants have it. The spike protein is how the coronavirus enters cells, and N501Y is in a region called the receptor binding domain, which latches onto the cell. N501Y mutation may make the spike protein stickier, allowing it to bind to and enter cells more readily. The mutation doesn't seem to affect immunity from vaccines. N501Y is not unique to these three variants, it's been found in a number of sequences around the world. What is unusual about these three variants is that they also have an additional constellation of other mutations in other parts of the virus. The UK variant has more than a dozen other mutations. It's growing more prevalent, not just in the UK, but also in Ireland and Denmark, two other countries that regularly sequence large numbers of samples. The CDC recently warned that it's likely to become the dominant variant in the United States by March. The South Africa and Brazil variants also have a second and third mutation in common in the spikes receptor binding domain, E484K and K417. The E484K mutation switches a negatively charged amino acid for a positively charged one. It's like flipping a magnet. This change seems to work in synergy with N501Y mutation to make the virus better at binding to cells. The South Africa and Brazil variants might have an additional advantage. Viruses with E484K mutation might be better at evading antibodies of recovered COVID-19 patients. Both variants were originally found in parts of the countries that have had high levels of COVID-19 infection, especially in Manaus, Brazil. There is a new COVID-19 variant found in California. The coronavirus will keep evolving. Thank you for listening. Subscribe to Diseases Simplified for more health tips and updates.